Hello, I'm McCann. I'm Dr. Fendi here. Um, I have a lump on my ball, and I was wondering if the bowel can affect the cancer or not. Um, yeah, let me see if we have an appointment for you here. Uh, what's your name, sir? Uh, Chris Gonzalez. Yes, we have an appointment for you right here. The doctor will see you at room two. Alright, thank you. Skill set do I need to take care of this patient? You need to have an artistic skill set in order to take care of this patient right here. What mindset I need to continue to help him with? In order to continue helping him, you have to have an innovative skill. Now hold on, sir. This is going to be a good ride. I've been chatting this whole time, and I just want to ask you some more questions about like your job and everything. Well, what do you want to ask me? Oh, like, how, like what is the range of like salary in career? I'm looking forward to getting into the deal. Well, it's about fifty thousand to one hundred seventy thousand dollars each year. So, like, do you know how the job outlook is turning right now? Like, is it going up or is it going down? Um, it's pretty. It's looking pretty upward. You know, growth each year about two point five. So what are the responsibilities like do I need to know besides like helping other patients, taking blood, like what else do I need to know? Well you need to also study and you need to you just need to focus on your your job. Yeah. Um, like, so where would I work? Like would I, would I be working in a hospital? Like, where, like how did how did you get to where you are right now? Um, I researched and developed many things within the laboratory that we have inside of this facility. What, like, how far is your education? Like, how far did your education take you to get to this position? Um, well, first I went to get my bachelor's, and then after that I went to grad school to finish up. So, are there any other related careers to this? Like, if you weren't a biochemist, like, what else could you be? Well, I would be a biophysicist, a biochemist engineer. Or maybe if you stretched out your DNA from one cell, how long would it be? Six feet.